Dum -dum -dum. Just digging on the music. Kids, it's a great day. It is Revitalization Day, Revitalization Friday. This is the day that we all been waiting for. Everything that I've been worrying about and fighting about and fighting for has been cleared up today. First off, guess whose business got shut down today? Cool Radiators! Yes! Cool Radiators! Cool Radiators was shut down today. The investigative agent from the DMV slapped them with a cease and desist order. I don't know what the remedy is for that, but right now they can't do business. And she also notified the Secretary of State and all the licensing agencies, I guess the county and the city licensing agencies. She thinks that there's something shady there. Probably the sales tax issue. I feel like Charlie Sheen. I gotta get myself a t-shirt that says winning. And yet, I'll get Charlie Sheen a t-shirt that says old fart new star. <laughs> so, one down, can you believe? I told you, it just takes a little bit of persistence, you know? People walk away with their tail between their legs like, well, okay, I'll just deal with it. Just another fuck over by America, by the system. It doesn't have to be that way. It takes a while, it's a process. But if you just stay with it, have a little stick with it in this, and be willing to take all the steps, you will win. Second, HOA. I win! I win! Da -da -da! This is a letter from their lawyer addressed to me. Miss Fisher! I won the battle. The war isn't over, but I won the battle. They're saying about this uh, violation is that because of what I said to them, the, my correspondence with them and the things that I pointed out that they uh, didn't do right. The violation of plugging my RV into my house is not a violation because until the next board meeting, March 29th, it is not a violation for me to plug my RV into my house. I have to go and argue the point, which is the way that it should be. If a neighbor comes up and, com and says that you're causing a nuisance, don't you have a right to face your accuser? Fine. And you know what? By March 29th, I'll be gone anyway. So I wrote him back and I said, uh, to appear at that meeting, I gotta appear by Skype. So please let the board know so that we can make the, the necessary arrangements. I won. So I'm elated, which is great because my God, they have just sucked the life out of me. I can't believe it. But now I realize, just keep calm. Keep calm, read, assess, and just say what you gotta say. So now I can have the RV plugged in. I can piss off my troll at the same time. Happy days are here again. The skies above are clear again. And third, I got a clean bill of health from the doctor yesterday. I went, all my tests came back okay, and now they kind of know what the problem was. I have a hypothyroid thing where my thyroid doesn't work so good, okay? And now it's blown out of control. So where your TSH level is supposed to be between two and four, mine was 29. That means my thyroid really isn't working. And that is why I'm fat. This is why I'm fat. This is why I'm fat. This is why, this is why, this is why I'm fat! This is why, this is why, this is why I'm fat. This is why, this is why, this is why I'm fat. Ha ha ha! Nurse told me that I probably won't lose weight until the thyroid gets back into whack. And, and you know what? It's a crutch that I'm gonna lean on. And I just may go to McDonald's before the night is over. Ye freaking ha! And pretty much that's about it. That's my news. Three nice big chunks, and I want to thank you guys so much for sticking for sticking by me and giving me the support that you did. I swear to I swear to you, it is not ever that I am standing with anyone shoulder to shoulder who's like, yeah, I'm willing to go up against that. Would you let's go? You know, it's one of those things where everybody's stand, standing in a line and they say, who volunteers to do this? And everybody else steps one step back and I'm left standing over here. So I look like I stepped forward. I'm not used to people coming up and saying, you got this girl, you got this. They're usually like, why are you making trouble? 
I'll never win. They always win. You won't win. Well, I won. Thanks for listening to me. Thanks for being there. Oh, oh. and that report from the DMV compliance agent will really turn out to be helpful in court. Ha <laughs> ha! Shifty, what are you doing? Come here, you little nut job. Come here. Here he is. Here's my boy. <laughs> He's nice and clean. I gave him a bath last night. Oh my God, lost his mind. Hey, Chef, what are you doing? I just looked a minute ago. He had a chewy in his mouth. Ones that I gave him like uh, weeks ago and I haven't bought since. I'm like, where did you get that? He is such a, such a shifty fellow. I love you, sweetie. Come on up here, say hello. Say hello. And kids, I'm gonna edit this, get this up really quickly and I'm gonna rest tonight, okay? Because tomorrow I have some friends coming over who are gonna help me finish uh, going through my, I almost said going through my shit, They're going through my stuff and help me pack the rest of my stuff and they're going to take a lot of it, the stuff that they want and, excuse me, we're going to put stuff out to have a yard sale, alright? So why don't you come over and buy some of my stuff? <laughs>